Hello everyone, I'm back. Okay, I just challenged myself to record and release a video today. So it's gonna be a short one, no fancy editing, just me hitting record and talking to you directly. First, I would like to thank you all for your encouraging message. My previous video performed like sh but it's okay, I'm proud of it. And second, I would like to tell you about the exciting upcoming collaborative project that I'm working on. Project Longshot or Lengshot is about building together a weapon, which is gonna be the world best DIY slingshot rifle. Or at least try. I spent around 21 hours on it and here is the result. As you can see, I have reached a certain point where you can all have a taste of the possibilities. That's some nice progress, but I think that we can go much further together. Right now it's on pause, but I hope to finish it before the end of the year. In the meantime, I've made a GitHub repository to grant you all free access to it. Everything is inside. However, it's far from done. Lots of work to do. For example, there's the handle that need to be correctly designed. Oh, I felt in love with the Reximex handle. Absolutely lovely one. Mine is fine, but next to it, it's meh. So I let you, people who know how to do 3D sculpting, like with Blender or T-Spline Infusion 360, deal with that. I'd rather focus on functional aspect anyway. There is the trigger mechanism. Oh, there is the front fork, which I think should be reworked around flat band instead of tube one. Those are, I think, better and easier to install and more powerful also. And then there is a system for the cross, retractable or easily removable. That will be better. We need to design a way to mount accessories easily. Picatinny rails will do it. Six, we need to make it more secure. The system of reloading isn't ideal. Trust me, it can be dangerous. Seven, we have to use some bigger rods, maybe two, three, four, or extruded aluminum profile. I don't know, many other things, etc, etc, etc. Anyway, all of this will be open source and people will modify it however they want it. That's, that's great. By the way, here's an advice as a designer. One, I see all of what's in the market. Two, I pick the best from here and here. Three, I synthesize everything. Four, I try to improve the result even more. That's how you end up with something exceptional. Sometimes it's needed to have a real model in order to get how it feels, how the product is. And that's why I've purchased this Fly Mars 2022. That was more than two months ago. And today, finally, I can unwrap it for the video. <laughs> oh, that's actually the reason why I made this video. Pfft, what a filthy mother Okay, so let's unwrap our inspirational model, take a look at every part and end this video. Uh, hello there, it's 5am, I failed my challenge, I will actually need another day to release the video, so uh, I, uh, I messed up, I can't really talk really loud right now, someone is sleeping, uh, someone is sleeping there. But anyway, yeah, this is the part I was talking about. And, uh, oh, well, it's over. Goodbye. And that's all, guys and girl. I wish you all an excellent day. I will see you all on the next one. This was one of Hyperium. Don't forget to live through your project. Take care of yourself. Goodbye.